Hello everyone and welcome to another video. This video, I'm gonna do a ranking of all of the best post seasons in sports that I know of or kind of know of. Maybe I never watched it, but we're gonna do best baseball, basketball, football, etc., etc. So, hey, for more content like this, make sure to like the video. We wanna get 10 likes on this video. We're gonna begin with what I see, the College Baseball World Series. Now, if you're a big baseball fan, congrats to you. I do not watch the College um, World Series. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know if it's lit or not. I watch the MLB playoffs, but I do not watch the College World Series. I don't even know if there's like a, it's like, is it like, if you are an MLB fan, is this like the NCAA tournament or basketball when it's, you know, one game elimination? And if it is, I may watch it because that is interesting. So, but I'm going to just put you, I never watched. Um, FCS. So NCAA FCS football, I believe that's different than FBS. Obviously FCS is the lower ranked schools. Um, I'm going to say it's okay. The reason why I'm saying it's okay is nothing crazy, obviously, because there's not a lot of like relevant schools in there. But Sam Houston State, I did go to Sam Houston State and they did win a championship a couple years ago. So shout out to my Sam Houston State Bearcats. I'm going to put that at okay. Also, also one thing y'all know, this is all going to be ranked. So even if it's tier one or okay, it's going to be ranked the best. It'll just be by itself. So March Madness is here. And as you know, March Madness is lit. So what am I going to put March Madness, man? You know, I'm going to put March Madness tier one. It gets everyone really excited. Your school is in this. Say, you know, most a lot of people's school are in these and they get excited. It's also one game elimination. So a lot of heartbreakers. And a great thing about March Madness is that there tends to be some extreme crazy moments, extreme buzzer beaters, things of that nature. So March Madness is lit. And the women's March Madness is also like, there's actually even more of a draw to that than the men's because there's a lot of really good, you know, female basketball players in this tournament with Caitlin Clark and Angel Reese and all them. So, you know, there's a lot of excitement with that. I'm putting you at tier one. So the MLB playoffs, the MLB playoffs, I'll tell, you know, people will say that baseball is so boring, but the MLB playoffs in all honesty is the most stressful playoffs for me because it's like, you know, when you're, these games are so close and then you can't just win in regulation in terms of like there's a time limit to it you have to get the people out you have to generate 27 outs to win and if you're if your closers are like selling and they're just not doing their job then you know a lead that you thought you had can go away instantly and it's just the most stressful thing ever because you have to get them out right you the closer had to finish the job the time doesn't save you so you know the mlb postseason is very interesting also Another thing, parity is really big in the MLB as well. Usually the same teams don't win. Look at the Dodgers that's been like the one that had the best record in the MLB, you know, maybe MLB for many years and only have one World Series of it. I'll put you right behind the March Madness. I, people don't get as hype for this. I think MLB has a marketing issue, honestly. I think they don't, don't, they don't do a good job of marketing. So I'm going to put you right now, tier one, put you right there. NBA. As of right now, I'm put you at the best. We'll see. Obviously, I'm a you know in my mind, I'm gonna figure out. I'm gonna see if I can change anything. Right now, I'm put NBA as the best. I just love the fact that you know, obviously, it's simply a seven game series, but these seven game series are very, very intense. And a game seven in the NBA is so amazing. And you know, the NBA Finals is great. I will tell you, if this was like 2018, 2017, I wouldn't put this at the best because the Golden State Warriors were dominating the world. But, you know, the fact that right now there's parity in the NBA, you know, the Nuggets just won. You know, I, I, I like I like the NBA playoffs right now the best. And which brings me to its biggest competition is the NFL playoffs. And obviously, if you know in the comments, you're going to say, hey, I think the NFL playoffs is better. Hey, I agree with the NBA playoffs is better, etc. The NFL playoffs versus the NBA playoffs is very interesting. Um, the NFL playoffs is really great. And the game you know week by week you know every week there's a great you know usually a lot of really good games happen sometimes there's a stinkers super bowl if i said the best like championship event i would say the super bowl obviously nfl would win if i was talking strict american sports um i honestly you know i'll pick i'm gonna pick mm, i'll pick the nba i'm pick the nfl tier one right here it's really close because there isn't parody right now because the Chiefs are dominating everyone. And it's kind of predictable now who you know is going to win. I like the NBA playoffs because it's longer. It's two months long. There's games first couple of weeks. There's games every single day. A lot of things are happening more often. So I just like that style. And I think a game seven, 
is more appealing in most term most times because of the fact that it's like a battle to the end so i'm definitely gonna put i'll put the nfl playoffs tier one and y'all may disagree with me but i'm put you tier one below the best nhl i have never watched the stanley cup i i'm gonna put you know i'll put i've watched some games i've watched by i'm gonna put you at okay i'm put you up for me and i know that you know i'm gonna put you at never watch i'm not gonna hold you like that because i've never watched it I assume it's very exciting, and if you're a hockey fan, I assume that's like amazing to you. But I have never watched that, so I'm just gonna say never watched the FIFA World Cup. If I was a big soccer fan, or if I was just like FIFA World Cup, definitely, definitely would be the best if it wasn't opinionated. But for me, I've watched some of it, but I haven't watched all of it. I haven't really got into soccer as much, so I'm not gonna put it. I'm gonna put it right now. I'm gonna put it ahead. To me, I'm gonna put it ahead of the baseball one because I know the the championship between Messi and Mbappe was like really great. So that's a really great way to get into soccer. I'm gonna put you at, I'm put you there, but I'm not gonna put you at, I'm not gonna put you higher because I. this is my opinion, as you know. And if you disagree, make sure to comment down below what you think, you know, tell me what your order should be. Um, I don't know, I'm saying, I don't know what this is. I don't know if that's the same exact thing as the college football playoffs. I'm just gonna put it down there. And the college football playoffs, I'm gonna put you, you know, you're definitely, you're definitely tier one. Most of these are going to be tier one, right? Um, this is the ranking, right? But tier one, should I put you ahead of March Madness? I actually like it more than March Madness. I won't lie to you. I like March Madness is great. Obviously, college football playoffs is the same style. And it's one game eliminations. I think they're adding more teams, which is going to help a lot in terms of making this really good. You know, I might do. I might put March Madness ahead of you. Until, until I see that finished product, I'm going to put March Madness ahead of you. But the college football playoffs definitely is a banger. I know people are going to be like, Jesse, how in the hell did you put this over the World Cup? I haven't watched a lot of the World Cup, so I don't know. But I will, I will next World Cup coming, I will watch some more games. And I'm actually going to see if I can get into soccer. But so with looking at this, my ranking is NBA playoffs is the best. NFL playoffs, number two. March Madness, number three. College football playoffs, four. World Cup, five. Uh, MLB, six. And that's sad because MLB is the most stressful for me. So it's crazy. It's that little. And FCS, FCS is seven. And I have no opinion on the other three. So if you agree with this list, make sure to comment down below and make sure to like this video. Get this video 10 likes and I'll do another tier list. Um, but hey, thank you guys for watching the video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more dope content like this. And hey, I'm going to catch you guys on the next video. And I'm out of here. Peace.